Hi guys, it's me again, Tyler Digger 2020 Productions, and on Wednesday, NASCAR revealed the 2023 schedules for all three of their national series. And being that their 75th anniversary is on that same year, tonight I will go over all of them, starting with the Cup Series. Now as you guys can see, the Bushlight Clash at the Coliseum does not move, and neither do. Daytona 500 qualifying, the Daytona Duels, or the first seven races of the regular season, including the Daytona 500 itself. However, Auto Club Speedway will run its final race on the old two-mile configuration before it turns into a short track. Speaking of short tracks, Bristol Dirt swaps dates with Martinsville. Talladega and Dover Don't Move Kansas swap states with Darlington. The All-Star Race comes to North Wilkesboro, NASCAR's first trip here since 1996. The Coke 600, Gateway, Sonoma, and Nashville do not move. The Cup Series takes to the streets of Chicago for the very first time. Atlanta, New Hampshire, and Pocono do not move. The second Richmond race moves to its July date. Michigan does not move, the Indy Road Course returns to its original August date, and the rest of the races do not move. However, Daytona will still be the regular season finale, Darlington the playoff opener, and Phoenix the championship race. How many off weeks are on this schedule? One. What race am I looking forward to the most on this schedule? The Chicago Street Race, of course, now on to the Xfinity Series, ladies and gentlemen. As you can see, the first seven races of the regular season do not move like I said before. Martinsville moves up a week, Talladega and Dover don't move like I said before. The first Darlington race moves up a week. Um, uh, Charlotte and Portland do not move. The Xfinity Series comes to Sonoma Raceway for the very first time. Nashville does not move. The Xfinity Series takes to the streets of Chicago for the very first time. Atlanta, New Hampshire, and Pocono do not move like I said before. For the first time since 2020, Road America returns as a, um, a standalone race. Michigan does not move, and the Indy Road Course returns to its original August date like I said before. Watkins Glen, Daytona, and a second Darlington race do not move either. Kansas will now become the regular season finale. Bristol is now the playoff opener with Texas coming after that. And the rest of the races do not move. However, Phoenix will still be the championship race. How many off weeks are on this schedule? Five! That's a lot, man! And what race am I looking forward to the most on this schedule? Sonoma, of course. Last but not least, the Craftsman Truck Series, ladies and gentlemen. So as you can see, the first four races of the regular season do not move. Texas becomes a standalone race for the first time since 2019. Bristol Dirt Swap States with Martinsville, like I was saying before. Also, the same can be said for Kansas and Darlington. The Truck Series comes to North Wilkesboro for the first time since 1996. Charlotte, Gateway, Nashville, Mid-Ohio, and Pocono do not move. Richmond moves to its July date, like I said before, and is now the regular season finale. Indianapolis moves to its August date and is once again the playoff opener. For the first time since 2009, the Truck Series returns to the, um, uh, historic Milwaukee Mile. And like I said before, the rest of the races do not move. However, Phoenix will still be the championship race. How many off weeks on this schedule? Oh my goodness, guys, you're not going to believe this. 14, ladies and gentlemen! What race am I looking forward to the most on this schedule? Milwaukee, of course. Well, what did you guys think of the, um, uh, schedules that I just covered? Let me know in the comments below, alright?
Well, guys, that wraps up this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And if you're new here, click on that notification bell so you won't miss a single upload. Bye-bye, everybody. And until next time, this has been Tyler Digger 2020 Productions, signing off.